Some of you may be familiar with the colour transparencies that you put over printed paper that help uh, learners with Erlen syndrome or scotopic light sensitivity to read the, the information more clearly. Uh, we're going to look at SS Overlay which does a similar uh, job on a computer. So it's not immediately obvious where the SS Overlay is when you first start it because it defaults down to the system tray and you can see here there's the yellow or golden arrow that points upwards. So by simply by right clicking onto the arrow then going into settings it's very simple there's two options you can change the transparency or the colour. So let's put it down to yellow. Click onto the yellow. I think there's about seven colours to choose from and it's when you start increasing the transparency you can see the difference that it makes. So if you are familiar with the colour transparencies or the colour overlays you use for printed uh, reading material then this does a similar job, you'll be familiar with this. So once again if I want to then change the colour just simply going back into the options again into the arrow back into the settings and change the colours. There's a nice aqua blue and OK to that. Now again it's not obvious where you close it down either so you have to go back into the down to the arrow and then you can see there's the exit option, click on to exit and that gets rid of it. And of course the old key keyboard combinations of Alt and F4 will also get rid of it as well.